Okay, YouTube, it's the shotgun's turn. A couple weeks ago, I posted a video using my Ruger LC9 S Pro shooting 9mm full metal jacket through the chest of drawers. And surprise, surprise, they went right on through. So uh, today, I thought I'd break out another home defense uh, specialty, the 12-gauge shotgun. This is a Mossberg 590A1. I'm going to be shooting some low recoil, a one round of low recoil uh, slug at uh, 1050 feet per second muzzle velocity. Then I'll move on to a rifled slug hollow point from Winchester, moving at 1600 feet per second muzzle velocity. And then the third round will be some double lot buckshot, nine pellets at 1325 feet per second. I'll uh, be using the shotgun here. Let me put the camera down and we will uh, commence shooting. Okay, hopefully we're in frame. Safety's off. Gun is hot. Let me put the old safety glasses on. Not that I think I'm going to need them. I'll put the low recoil slug through the top drawer. Oh, <laughs> forgot to load it. I'm sure you saw a nice flinch. All right, let's go down range and see what we got. This was the low recoil, the higher velocity uh, slug, and then down in the bottom drawer were the uh, double lot buckshot. Let's see what the backside looks like. Oh, yes, low recoil, high velocity, and the double lot buckshot tore that apart there, too. It's kind of hard uh, to see. I'll see if I can open up the drawer and see what's uh, what's in there. Well, opening up the drawer, I can see that only a couple went out the back of the drawer. Uh, the others went down through the bottom of the drawer. Uh, there's the back side of the drawer. When I pulled on it to open it, it popped off uh, the, the actual uh, rest of the drawer the face did. So uh, there you have it. Chest of drawers versus the 12 gauge shotgun think about it when you're using it for home defense thanks for watching